Hello, lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. All you curl friends and guys out there that have been following me, thank you so much. And for those of you that this is your first time coming to my channel, make sure you subscribe to the channel and also hit the little button, the little bell right next to the subscribe button so that you will get notifications every time I come up. I'm out of breath because I just got out of the shower and I'm so excited because when I was in the shower, this is my first wash after my big chop last week and I noticed that when I had cut off all the relaxed hair that my 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 curls showed up it's amazing anyway stay tuned I'll be back and you guys are going to go with me as I style my hair today and get ready for a big event this weekend don't go nowhere Okay, so I am going to, I just got finished, uh, I deep conditioned my hair with Beautiful Textures Rapid Repair Deep Conditioner. And uh, I put that on my hair, I put my hair in four, um, six maybe, Bantu knots, and I got under my heating cap for about 30 minutes. So now I'm going to, uh, I just got finished putting in some uh, leave-in conditioner by Cantu Shea Butter. I'm gonna try this can too. You know, I was having problems with this uh, when I had the two textures. I was having problems with it in my hair. I don't know why, it just made my hair feel funny. And I still have my shea butter mixture that I made a long time ago. Not a long time ago, but yeah, a while ago. It kept pretty good because I kept it in a dark place, in a cool place. This has uh, castor oil, pure castor oil, organic, um, shea butter, almond oil, and other oils in it. And I'm also going to try this. This is Shea Moisture's uh, Coconut and Hibiscus Curl Enhancing Smoothie. Um, and I'm going to, it's going to take me a while to get through this, but I will do my best not to bore you along the way. So, so I've got my hair sectioned off as best I can. This is different because, um, I'm used to having more hair, so <laughs> I'm used to just combing it out and just. So if you see me looking over here to my uh, my right, your left is because I am using this mirror here um, to get it done because I've got it a little bit sitting closer to me. It's a better picture. So let's see here. I'm going to take a little bit of this. I know it looks like a lot, but it's kind of not. I think this is like a gel of some type. I don't know. Anyway, I've already combed through here, but my hair is kind of curly. So I'm gonna do it again. And I mentioned about the uh, pyramid method that I use. I use my wide tooth comb. Now I'm going to the next size comb, comb through. And then I'm doing my fine tooth comb that just came in the mail today. I ordered this and there's no tangles. And I ordered this because it's got the wire, um, the metal tip on it for a, a better um, sectioning of your hair when you can want to go part it. All right, so I'm gonna give it a twist, two strand twist. And hopefully this will turn out nice. It sure smells good. And you gotta twist it all the way to the end. I don't know how this is gonna turn out. We'll find out. I've never used this, this product before. I may have tried it once when I had the two textures and I didn't like it, so I gave it to my daughter. And then I cut my two textures off, so I took it back. So. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see how it turns out. So there's two. And I'm going to do my whole head and it's going to take me a while. So I will come back to you guys when I'm finished doing this and show you how it looks after I'm done. All right? Don't go anywhere.
and ta-da! So there you go. The finished product, a gazillion two-strand twist. Now, what I did read was that you, you have to twist your hair in the direction that you want it to lay. So this looks a little weird. <laughs> but anyway, we'll see how it turns out. So I have, I don't even know how many of these I have. A lot. I have a lot of them. I noticed that this piece of hair here didn't shrink very much. And I, uh, which tells me that there's damage there. So I don't know, maybe I can restore the elasticity to it over time, get it healthy. Uh, and then I don't know if it's because that gray hair has a different texture than the rest of your hair. I don't know. Anyway, I'll turn around and let you see the back. And I'm going to leave it this way. I'm going to leave it this way um, for two or three days. I'll just, I'm going to let it air dry and I'll keep it tied up so that it'll lay flat. It won't be sticking up and looking crazy. And anyway, that's the finished product of my gazillion two strand twist. And I will try to remember to take a picture once I take it out. I'll be going out this weekend, going out of town for a little bit. And, um, and I will try to remember to take a picture so that you guys can see what it's like. But I want to show you using the pyramid method. I told you I started with a wide tooth comb. I went to a medium tooth comb. That sparkle is. And then I went to my silk comb uh, in that order. That's the order that I use it in. And that's the hair that came out. Just very, very, very little. So I'm pleased about that because before I had a lot of hair coming out and I think the processed hair was, it was just causing my hair to snap and it was breaking off too. So I'm glad that's over with. I expect some, some breakage and I expect some um, shedding. I think that's normal. So there you go. That's a wrap folks. Thanks for coming by. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to push the button. Click on the little button next to the subscribe. Um, button so that you can get updates whenever I do a, um, a updated video and recommend this channel to your friends. If you're enjoying it, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps in the ratings and all. I'm not trying to, I don't get paid for my channel. Believe me, I don't. So I would just like more people to see what I'm doing, especially people uh, that have gray hair or graying hair. I would really like for you to recommend this channel to them. If they're thinking about going natural, if they are natural and they're having challenges, I'd like to hear from them and see what challenges they're doing. And also make sure you leave in the description box, I mean in the comment section, anything you want me to talk about. And um, I will do my best to do that. All right. Okay. So thank you for stopping by and I'll see you the next time.